guys, it's me, Brie14, and as you guys can tell, I'm sitting right next to my Christmas tree, and that is because I'm going to be starting to do my holiday videos for you all. I'm super duper excited for it, and I'm super duper excited for Christmas. So today's video is going to be the Holly Jolly Holiday Tag number two, and this is the, I didn't want to do Holly Jolly Holiday Tag number one because I felt like the questions for this tag was much better, and I just felt like doing this one. So I hope you guys don't mind that. So let's just jump right into the video and get right started. So number one is, do you start your Christmas shopping on Black Friday or wait until last minute? I definitely start my Christmas shopping um, right after Black Friday, if not on Black Friday, because I really am, I'm a sucker for like, you know, getting things done and not doing things at last minute. So I usually do my um, Christmas shopping um, after Black Friday. I just feel like it's not too late or not too early to shop at that time. So that's the, usually, that's the usual time that I um, start my Christmas shopping. Number two is, if you could be in any Christmas movie, what would it be? I would definitely be in the movie Home Alone. I know it's a little um, scary to be home alone, and, but um, I think I'd be able to, you know, keep um, Kevin some company, and I'd be able to help him, like, hit those um, burglar's butts, and I just think it would be, like, a really funny um, movie for me to be in, so that's the movie that I would definitely be in um, if it was a Christmas movie to choose. Number three is, which do you like better, Christmas Eve or Christmas Day? Honestly, I think Christmas Day is, like, really fun and really interesting because you guys get to, like, you know, prepare for Christmas Day and whatnot. Um, but I do like Christmas Day better because that's the actual day where everyone has been waiting for. You get to open your presents. You get to um, spend time with your family. So I definitely think Christmas Day is better than Christmas Eve, but Christmas Eve is pretty good, too. So I really don't know. <laughs> but definitely Christmas Day. Um, number four is, when does your family put up your Christmas tree and who decorates it? We usually put up our Christmas tree right after Thanksgiving, usually the day after Thanksgiving. And I'm going to be honest with you, um, my brother and I usually put up our Christmas tree for my mother, but not my, my, not my dad. I don't know why. He just doesn't feel like putting up the Christmas tree with us. He's just like the type that where he like chill and just watch us put up the Christmas tree. Um, but yeah, usually my brother and my um, mom helps me put up the Christmas tree. Number five is white lights or colored lights. I definitely think white lights and colored lights are really pretty. Um, it really depends. Like my tree, it has like white lights on it, and that's because we have like a whole bunch of ribbons and different, you know, colors and things on it. So it really does depend. I really don't know, but I do choose Christmas um, white lights rather than you know colored lights because I feel like it's just more plain and it, it's just like like a classic, you know. So. I do choose white lights over colored lights. Number six is, are you guilty at peeking at your presents or do you like the surprise? I'll be honest with you guys, I love to peek at my presents and I've been doing this since I was real, um, since I was younger and I just feel like it's just the thing that you have to do, like come on, like <laughs> um, when there's a new present under my tree, I always look to see if it's mine, I don't know, I'm just so excited for Christmas so that's usually what I tend to do. Um, but I am not guilty about doing that because I never find out what I actually have. So I guess it's all right. <laughs> um, I never find out like what I actually have under the tree. And I usually look, but it's never something that I want. Yeah. Um, number seven is, would you rather live in a gingerbread house or Santa's workshop? I would definitely live in a gingerbread house rather than Santa's workshop because I'm going to be honest with you guys, I am a little lazy and I do not want to make presents for everyone. I know it's a nice thing to do, but I'd rather chill in the gingerbread house and just relax with that dude, you know? He's awesome, so yeah. Number eight is, tell us your Christmas Eve traditions. Um, my Christmas Eve traditions are usually my family. Um, we usually just do some last minute shopping. Um, I know I told you I don't really like doing last minute shopping, but um, sometimes we just have to get like two things or one thing or so um, just to, you know, top it off and just get that person something amazing. So that's usually what we do together. We don't usually do anything other, um, any other tradition, Christmas tradition. So we really don't know. I think that's the only thing. Um, number nine is if you could be under the mistletoe with anyone, um, who would it who would it be? Uh, speaking like celebrity wise, I would definitely choose either Jack Glinski 
Nick Hall or Kian Lawley. If you like any of those three guys, um, definitely like this because, yeah, I definitely want to be on the mistletoe with one of them. Um, number 10 is What Tops Your Tree? I wish I could show you guys, but uh, a Christmas, um, like, golden star tops my tree. I know some people like to put up, like, um, angels or such or stars, but my family just have like, a big golden star. Um, so, yeah. Can you name the 12 days of Christmas? Um, no, I can't name the 12 days of Christmas. I'm so embarrassed right now. I'm so sorry, guys. You guys probably think I'm like, really? You don't know how to, you know, name the 12 days of Christmas? You have no Christmas spirit? Um, I do have Christmas spirit, but I just didn't memorize them. I don't know why. I usually listen to that song, like, usually once a year, so I really don't know the 12 days of Christmas. That sucks. Um... Number 12 is, have you ever gone Christmas caroling? No, I have not ever went door-to-door -door Christmas caroling, but when I was younger in elementary school, I definitely did some caroling in like concerts and such, if you, that's, if that counts. Um, I don't know if that really counts, does that count? I don't really know. Um, but I never like went door-to-door. -door. I did sing some Christmas carols like in concerts and plays and such when I was younger, but I never went like door-to-door -door, like actual caroling. Uh, number 13 is, do you count down to Christmas? If so, how many days are left? Hello, everyone counts down to Christmas. Like, Christmas is awesome. Like, I'm so excited right now. I'm just so excited to even make this video for you guys. Um, there is exactly nine days. Um, there will be eight days when I will be posting this video, but, ah, that's like in like a week or so and that's just amazing oh my gosh i'm so excited and that is literally insane so that's how many days it's till christmas number 14 is what are some foods and treats you can count on on having every holiday season um, i definitely really um count on having like ham and eggnog and candy canes hot chocolate all that like festive holiday christmas food that everyone has um definitely look forward for like you know hot chocolate and such even though i don't really drink hot chocolate otherwise but on christmas i do i really don't get that but yeah that's usually what i look forward to um to um so yeah even candy canes Number 15 is, how has Christmas kept its magic for you as you've grown older? Uh, Christmas has always kept its magic for me. I've always loved Christmas. Christmas is my favorite holiday. Um, Christmas is just the, you know, holiday where you spend time with your family, you give to other people, and, you know, you just really have a good time and spend time with your family, like I said. And it is Jesus' birthday, and I am, you know, Christian, so it just really does mean a lot to me. Um, so Christmas is just perfect for me, and I absolutely love that holiday so much. Um, but also because, you know, I never had a bad Christmas, and I'm hoping to never have a bad Christmas because Christmas is just literally the best holiday in my opinion, and I love it. So, um, that's also how I just keep positive with that and, you know, have a really good Christmas for each year. Um, so that was the last question. I do tag all of you guys, but before I end this video, I just wanted to show you guys my dogs in their little outfits. They have like Christmas um, sweaters on and I just wanted to show you guys. I thought it would work well with this video and let me just show you guys because they're so cute and <laughs> let me just show you. They're probably going to be mad at me for like trying to pick them up right now when they're sleeping. But this is what they look like. They're so cute and they're just in their Christmas sweaters. They're like matching twins and they're like so cute right now in their Christmas sweaters. So <laughs> um, so that's what they look like. I really hope you guys enjoy this video. I do recommend all of you guys to do this, um, this tag because it's amazing and it just really gets me in the Christmas spirit, if you know what I mean. So I really hope you guys like this video. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.